Hi you guys and welcome back. Thank you so much for all your love and support on my channel. I truly do appreciate it. Welcome to those of you new just tuning in. This is actually a bonus reading so it will be short. I will do an extended um, to it but it will also be short as well. So since it's general that means it's not going to resonate with everyone out in the, uh, the collective. So please keep that in mind. I do offer personal readings so if you want to book one of those with me that information is going to be below the video description where it says show more as well as all the decks I'm using here today. The majority of the items you see will be listed below as well as my Instagram, TikTok information and my Patreon link where you can get the extended version to this video and all of my uh, other videos okay so the candle I'm using is the kids desires love messages candles are listed below as well so if you hear me say he or she when I talk about the masculine or the feminine I'm just talking about energies and not a specific gender so the masculine or the feminine could be male or female just take it how it resonates or applies in your situation um, if it's resonating with you and also the energies can be flipped so when I say I'm talking about you I could be talking about your person so this is going to be like what someone really needs to hear right now so I'm just going to try to get one clear message and then um, this will be could be anything it could have to do with your a connection with someone a family member a friend your job project, whatever you're working on, a decision, something you're faced with, whatever spirit wants to uh, come through, we'll see. And then on the extended, I'll uh, focus on um, what is going on, what you really need to hear about the connection of, of a particular person that you're focused on. Okay, they could be related or completely separate. So let's go ahead and get started. So let's see what's the situation that someone really needs to hear right now. Um, this is my situations deck. If you live, oh, I forgot. I want to turn on the light here. Hold on, give me just a second. I just realized it's very dark. Let me move this over. Okay. Okay, that's better. <laughs> All right, so um, see if I can remember what I was saying. Oh, if you live in the United States and you're interested in my decks, you can get it from my site or my Etsy shop. But if you're international, interested in any of my decks, please send me an email below. I will send you a link to order. So I'm gonna go ahead and get three cards here for the main message of what someone really needs to hear right now. Let's see what it has to do with. And I'm gonna get all the cards out first. Okay, and I just realized I didn't have my timer on. Timer keeps me together, and so I must turn it on. Otherwise, I will get lost in the time. Okay. Start. Okay, so I probably been about at least two minutes, three minutes in. I don't know. All right. So we have twin flames. So some of you, this is a message about your twin flame or someone that you see as the one, mirrored souls, or someone that you're pledged to. And then the other uh, card we have here is searching online, looking for info, records. And then we have pressure, co pressure cooker rage ready to explode. Okay, so someone is, is what I'm getting is someone is looking for some type of information on this co connection and they're just, they're at the edge. They're ready to explode. Okay, either because they can't find out what's going on with the other person um, and it's causing them to have a lot of anger because they don't know what's going on. So if you're not in this energy, this certainly could be your person. So some of you, this is a twin flame and this, some of, uh, uh, you, this is somebody that, um, you feel is the one or you're pledged to, um, you could even be in a contract with this person, but somebody is, um, in this energy where they're enraged or ready to explode. So some could be angry. And some, this could be about passion, okay? That they're, you know, they're ready to explode in that energy. So let's get the cards to go along with this. This is the psychic tarot for the heart. What do you want to say about these energies of what someone really needs to hear right now? Just breathe. 
okay? So if uh, someone is really trying to figure out what's going on and it's causing you to be frustrated because you don't know if this connection is gonna come together, I do see a lot of flame, I see a lot of passion, and this is causing you to feel angry or you're ready to explode. Also, what I'm getting to is if there's something that you see online um, and it causes you to feel like you might be angry, just breathe, okay? Just breathe. This is the Four of Swords energy. This is about taking a break, okay? So I'm getting, so what you may be seeing may not be all, all the truth here. If this is you, that's in this energy. So what are we just breathing for? Uh, for? This is the um, Mermaid Tarot. What is this Just Breathe energy here for? Justice, okay? Um, what I'm getting here is just breathe, take a break. There will be justice, okay? There will be justice. And then what I'm also getting to there is there could be somebody just taking a break before there is justice. Some of you guys could be dealing with a Libra. Um, this could also be uh, legal matters. Someone may be leaving a, a legal situation as well because uh, that's what the four of swords could be about taking a break, retreating, mentally exhausted uh, from a situation. We have number 11. That could be significant. So we have four and we have 11. So let's go ahead and, and see what else is this message here that you really need to hear right now. Why is it just for you here with the justice card? Yeah, so crown chakra. So this is about being in your head and thinking. So it's like someone is either about to take a break, okay, um, from a relationship they're currently in or they're thinking about it. They're thinking about retreating from a legal situation that they have in here. I mean, in, in the a connection with someone else. Uh, we have seven, which is a very spiritual number, but someone is really in their head. And so what I'm getting is someone needs to take a break from um, either being in their head to whether there's going to be justice or not. And others, there's someone that may be taking a, leaving a situation that they're legally um, tied to. Okay, so let's get um, another message here. What else does someone really need to hear right now about this twin flame searching and pressure cooker? Throat chakra. So something about communication. So we do have um, some activation here in the head and the thoughts and in the throat. So someone is thinking about communicating. Okay. So if there is, if you are in this energy and you're thinking about communicating, um, I'm getting that spirit of saying to take a break, relax, because it may make you angry. You may um, explode, okay, on this person. And then, like I said, if it isn't that and it's someone else, they could be thinking about communicating, but they may be just uh, taking a break or spirit is telling you to take a break because this person is thinking about communicating Um is something is ready to explode like something is ready to come to the surface so we have five here which is fives are about change with seven spiritual numbers and fours are about uh, foundation so there is some throat chakra energy here so let's see what is this throat chakra here for why is this throat chakra here so we have the two of wands so there's some type of decision OK, it also could have to do with a partnership as well. Someone is in the water here. Um, they're they're in the water is all about emotions. So someone has made a decision, I feel like, um, to communicate, but they could be taking a break before they do this. So let me see. Why is the two of wands here? Why is the two of wands here? Why is the two of wands here? So we have listen, okay? So listen is the high priestess energy, okay? So this is also that quiet energy is uh, to listen. Um, some of you guys may be uh, consciously aware um, of this because this is our subconscious and our conscious 
uh, energy. So there could be something that you may be feeling or someone you're tied to is thinking about communicating their so if you are thinking about communicating or reaching out or responding um, to something, maybe something you even see online, just take a break. Think about it before you do that, okay? Follow your intuition, you know, just remove yourself from it because it may not have to do with uh, your twin flame. It could be just something you're legally tied to or, you know, bound to, something you're pledged to, like some type of contract or agreement. But there could be something where you may want to go off on somebody, but a spirit is telling you, just don't do that. Whoever this person is, don't do it. Just uh, listen, follow your intuition, take a break. And, you know, think the situation through. And then when you're more calmer, maybe you can um, communicate um, that message. Okay. And since I'm, a, I have a little bit more time, I'll do one more. All right. So let's go ahead and get another message here. What's another message that you spirit would like to communicate of what someone really needs to hear right now? Observe. Okay. See this? Observe. You observe something watch something, take a break, listen, follow your intuition. Or right, this is someone else's energy. So we have number 12. This is the hangman energy. So what is being observed in this energy? What is this observe here? So we have uh, a dedicated uh, effort. This is the um, Pinnacles energy. So this is about, you know, you know, putting that effort into the situation. So I'm getting here. Somebody could be watching you. Okay. Online. How you are um, putting in some type of effort, like a really, you know, a dedicated effort into something. And this could be causing them to feel upset, like ready to explode. So either they're upset or they're just ready to come forward towards you and communicate. Um, Cause that rage could be passion as well. Um, so this could be observing, somebody could be observing how you work and you're skilled and your craft and you're just really dedicated um, into what you're doing. And they're seeing you do this online and it could be making someone else upset or ready to explode where maybe they want to come forward now and, um, speak uh, to you okay um, but if this is in your your energy um, and someone puts you in this energy of being upset don't don't respond right away okay so let's get one more card of what is this dedicated effort rebuild yeah so this is a tower uh uh, energy here. This is tower card. So we have number 16. That could be significant. Um, it's also a seven. So we have a rebuilt. Okay. So some, I'm also getting like an additional message here is that if you've been working really hard, you've been working over time and all this stuff, and you're doing a lot of uh, work and you put into your craft, just take a break, take a break, rebuild your, yourself, your base, um, your body, and just take a pause from that and just relax, okay? Relax from, you know, trying to find out what's going on with your twin flame because it just might make you explode. Instead, just take a break uh, and not worry about anything. Just relax, okay? That's a, a strong message I'm getting here is just to relax. Don't focus too much on what you're seeing or take a break from that because it might make you, you know, be ready to um, explode here, okay? So... All right, so that's the message I'm getting. So if you're looking for information for your twin flame online, looking for some type of information, take a break because what you see might make you explode or if you don't see nothing, it could still have that same effect on you. Take a break um, from it, from that energy, follow your intuition, um, you know, pause and just uh, observe um, or, or take a break from putting in this, this uh 
effort into those things and put more effort into rebuilding yourself. And I'm also getting, like I said, somebody could be watching you as well. And this could also be making them ready to explode. Maybe they're having a lot of passion or they're just um, also I'm getting jealous. Somebody could also be uh, jealous of you. So just be aware of that. Um, be aware that, you know, there could be somebody that may want to test you. Don't respond. Take a break from it and just, you know, observe it. Just look at it, the situation before you say anything or speak. Okay. All right, you guys. So I'm going to take this over to extend it. Um, my link to the, the link to the Patreon is below. And then I will focus more on your person. For some of you, this is your person. Others, this is just something associated online and something legal. Okay. That might make you um, upset. Okay. Or this other person is observing you and is making up, uh, upset, whoever this is. But I will focus on your person and extend it. So if this resonated with you, please uh, hit the like button for me. Comment. If you're new to the channel, please subscribe. Again, anything you want to know is going to be listed below the video description where it says show more. So I want to thank each and every one of you for watching. Have a good day or night, whatever it is, wherever you are. Until next time, next video. Peace, love, and light.